great spotted woodpecker on our live camera at the moment. Absolutely amazing. Of course, this is a brilliant thing to have in your, if this were ever to come into your garden. More realistically, things like sparrows and robins are very attractable into your garden. But when it comes to putting food out, um, Paul, it's not as complicated as many people think, is it? It's not. I mean, there's a whole manner of different things you can do and put out in the garden to attract different birds. I mean, uh, putting out seeds is obviously a good thing. That'll attract different finches. Putting out um, uh, lard and things like that will attract the blue tits and the great tits. And another great thing is fruit will attract your winter thrushes like um, field fairs and red wings. And what about bread? Is that good to put out or not? It is in small quantities. If you blend it up in a mixer and have it in really small bits and put it out on the table, that's absolutely fine. But remember, in small quantities is best for the bread. And... Peanuts is interesting, isn't it? Because they mustn't be salted. That's very important, isn't it? But peanuts can be quite good. Yeah, you can get um, unsalted variety of peanuts. Um, we've got some here, but uh, yeah, the salted variety can do a bit of damage to the bird's digestive system, so it's advised not to do that, really. And when it comes to bird feeders and things like that, I mean, you don't have to have them, but they do help. Because some people have been emailing us saying, well, what well, do you get rats if you put food out in the garden? You can do that, can be an issue. It is compatible though, so if you, um, a lot of feeders nowadays come with trays at the bases so that it catches any falling seed. Um, bird tables, you can actually fasten um, upturned dustbin lids to the base again, that'll catch any falling scraps, hopefully preventing rats. And one other question is bacon rind any good one via email? Unsalted. Or... Unsalted bacon rind's perfect. Okay, thanks very much indeed. So if you are going to buy a bird feeder, if you want to go that little extra, um, extra mile, Rob, where would be a good place? in a garden to hang it? Well, when birds are feeding, they want to feel safe. Uh, so there's lots of things that like to make a meal out of blue tits and great tits, like sparrowhawks and cats. So it's always quite important to put the feeders somewhere near cover, if not under cover, so there's somewhere they can escape to sure. if, they feel struggle, if they feel safe. And water, very important, not just for drinking? No, no. So you'll have lots of birds coming to drink, drink from water, but also to bathe in. Um, you'll get amphibians and it's very, very important water.